morning. So I have just hitched up the trailer, just about to leave home, go to the yard, get Barney, and then we're off to Thailand. I'm done, one to go. Barney is rancid. Oh. last few bits in now and then we are on the road to the ferry so uh i'm only 10 minutes into my journey and i've already cracked the snacks out that's that's some good going record breaking stuff there left I think and I've only got 35 miles left in the tank so yeah so a quick stop I am um, did make a slight detour by accident um I was meant to come off at a junction it's too busy listening to tunes and singing away so I missed it which uh that added an extra 20 no 18 miles I think it's annoying but yeah I'm excited now we're nearly there I, I must get fuel because I was never going to get there. So I'm probably going to get told off in a minute if use my phone. So open it out. We're here. Oh, I'm so glad to be off the road now. That last 20 minutes dragged. Hi, Barnes. He's happy to be here too. Right, going to find everyone. Ready to come out, Buns? Yeah? You gonna come out, go in your new stable? Yeah. Muppet, look at all that mess you've made. I clean all that out this morning, just an easy night. Just had a really good lesson. Just my boots off. Um, Pippa was meant to ride today, but she's not feeling that great, so she taught me instead. Um, and one of the yard girls had a go on him. I'll just hold it a bit easier. One of the yard girls had a go on him and got him going really nicely. And Pippa was kind of like, you know, what's what's the problem? There isn't really a problem. Turns out I'm the issue, and it's not actually as bad as I feel. So I had a lesson on him and. There were some pretty shitty parts, but all in all, it was actually, it was a good lesson. It's productive. I've come away with stuff that I need to do. Um, yeah. Yeah, I've got this. I've got this. I've just got to make sure I keep going back. But tomorrow, I've got a lesson on the schoolmasters and then another lesson on him. And if Pippa's feeling any better, then she's going to have a sit on him. So just have a feel, um, which is really good. So yeah, I'm just making this dinner. Um, and then I'm gonna go get some dinner because I'm starving. It's only four o'clock. Jeez, I'm so hungry. So, I had the best sleep at Mel's house. I, I haven't laid in that long for so long. It was lovely. Nice cup of tea. And now I'm just heading down to her stables. See how she's getting on. Okay, so off to Talon I go. I need to put some slap on in the car because. That ain't a pretty sight. Um, so first lesson in the morning, I've got my schoolmaster lesson. I don't know who I'm riding yet. Um, 
but I'm excited for that because the last one went really well. Um, so I decided to do some fancy stuff. Um, then the plan for the day is Mel and I are going to go for lunch. We're going to get some shots of the new winter leggings um, and the new hats. And then back to Talland for around two o'clock because I've got a lesson on Barney. So yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Now to try and make my way to Talland without getting lost, which I don't know, could go one or two ways, I guess. We'll see. Come back for day two. Here we are. Hopefully, we've got a bit of rain. Oh. This is what I call service. My little ribbons. Right. Look at that stable. I've just turned up and it's done. And he obviously loved the bed because he was clearly been lying down. Hey. Hey. So all I've got to do is make a net. That's my god. Number two is about to commence. That's not a talent school master, is it? That's a Barney. Barney progressed slightly in the last lesson, but he's still got some work. So we are back on in 15 minutes, I think. That's not an impressed face. Just finished, and this guy was a superstar. Yes, he was. He was so so good. So pleased with him. Um, we have just booked our next week back at Talland for some intense training. I'm very excited because the progress we've made in the past two days is actually unreal. So yeah, exciting. Sadly, it is time to say goodbye to Talland. But it's not long to go back. It really is an amazing place. There's some amazing people. Everyone's so welcoming. Um, Barney's settled in really well. I could literally stay here forever. I wish I could. <laughs> but back to the Isle of Wight we go. And you've been amazing once again. We're off now. It's so sad. I don't want to go. But we have booked in for next time, which is exciting. He's happy to be back. So finally I'm home after a very exciting couple of days and I got a parcel. So you can see who it's from and I'm super excited. Oh, you wanna, you wanna open it as well? Super excited to open it. I'm not sure if I can do it one-handed. We'll see. Eh, maybe not. Okay, so that was definitely a two-handed parcel. I really struggled to get in there. Oh, it looks 
exciting. Oh, two portraits. I hope you have a wonderful birthday. Looking forward to seeing what friendly messages. Oh, that's so sweet. So get down out here. <gasps> oh, it's beautiful. Oh god, I'm so excited. So this is the GP jump saddle cover. Um, it also comes in a dressage saddle for your dressage saddles. It's fully lined with a sheepskin lining, which protects your saddle, which is really nice. So it's completely waterproof and the outside is really tough and durable. So you can either just put it on your saddle to store it or you can ride in it, which is really great. Um, it's also got these, I don't know if you can see, so like sheepskin girth sleeves. So when this is on your saddle and you're putting it away, then you can just tuck your girth into here. And there's one on this side and it keeps your girth in place and stops it falling off. Also this really great leather piping that goes around the cantle and it just ensures like a nice secure fit. And if you are gonna ride in it, then that really does hold it in place. I literally cannot wait to put this on my saddle tomorrow. I'll probably end up riding in it. To be honest, <laughs> so I don't ruin her. Um, but yeah, I'll show you tomorrow. It's dressage day. The boys are out. Um, Barney's been put out just for like 20 minutes. Just like muck out, empty out the car and trailer, and then he can come in and be platted. boot cleaning time I hate <laughs> boot cleaning time but I love the Belvoir tap cleaner I literally cover the whole thing with it <laughs> especially as I haven't really got the mud off it kind of loosened it off so then I use this Netex tack conditioner um I find that it brings boots up really nice so oh that's nice um, so basically, just give it a shake, and then I spray it all over my boots. Like that. And then I use a clean, dry sponge, and just work it into the leather. Right, so they're clean. In the bag they go. <clears throat> and I always like to put the supports in them just to stop them from dropping. Mm. Ready to go in the trailer. going away again. Right, we're leaving pretty much on time for once. Bounce. Yeah. Well, I say pretty much on time, we're like five minutes late, but I'll be okay.
Well, Barney was fantabulous. Be a good boy. Even he's very pleased with himself. I'm so, so happy. The scores can literally say fucking anything because this smile clearly sees that that was the best test we have done ever. I was so good. We were slow. Every canter lead was sharp. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> I, I could go home now. Don't do another one in case it comes shit. That was so good. You good boy, Pons. You good boy. Oh, I'm over the moon. I'm so, so pleased. <laughs> were you the best? Go on, have a selfie. Were you the best boy? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes. Oh, that felt so good. I'm so pleased. I can't, I can't contain my excitement. That was so on point. Just about to put my fine equine saddle cover on. I know it's not meant to go on this saddle, but I want to use it, so it's going on this saddle. <laughs> In all its beauty. Look at that. And it fits on the top so nice. That was good. The second test is really good. So our first test, we actually got some pretty good marks. Our collectors weren't that great. We just sort of rhythm out, but I'm pleased. We had a very, very good day. This weekend going to Talland has 100% helped us. And that completely showed in our tests because our transitions were like quick off the mark. Um, he didn't really pull me. He didn't rush. I mean, there were occasions where he rushed for like a couple of strides, but nothing like before and we were in that arena for many many minutes usually we go so fast we're in there in and out in like two minutes we were in there for much more than that this time so yeah very happy very pleased Is done. It actually went very well. We probably had all together maybe 10 strides that were a bit tense. Um, oh, nice hot chocolate mug I've got there. Hans, are you a good boy? Are we home? You are such a little star. Yes, you are. Mind your head. Oh, you got so many snacks. Look at your afro. Look at your little afro. Good boy. Yeah. So Barney was very good in his last test and we managed to come sixth, which is really good. Really, really pleased with him today. And I'm actually really pleased with us like as a pair, how we've come on in just a couple of days. Um, yeah. Really happy. Come on. Come on. Really, really happy. So now time to just put his outdoor clothes on. He can go and run around with his friends for a little bit before he comes in for bedtime. Hey, Bons. You don't look impressed. Come on, Bons. Where are you? There you are. Oh, you see your friends? Are you excited? Why do you feel the need? Shrink from that side. It's exactly the same. So we have just been out for dinner at our friends. I've just got to the yard to bring 
the boys in. <laughs> Sean's just gone to let them out. One. There we go. And Moose, can you stable? Good boy. Good man. Good boys. Good boys. Well, that's the weekend done. Back to reality tomorrow. I'm back to work. So, thanks for watching. Bye.